Well, Tommy, Hull City is your home for the next few months. How much are you looking forward to the challenge here? Yeah, delighted. Um, obviously, we, uh, we, we played Hull first game of the season. Um, was, was impressed by the way they played and, and as soon as the gaffer made the phone call, you know, it was, it was a no-brainer for me. Um, looking forward to getting going and getting all the paperwork and, and medical side of things done and, and, and getting on with the football. You were last seen scoring against us at the KCOM Stadium on the opening weekend. What's happened between then and now to, to make this move possible? Um, yeah, so obviously from Villa's point of view we got a, a positive result that day um, and then haven't featured in the league since. So sort of hungry to get out and, and get playing regular football again and, and being part of something and, and, and a group that's, that's uh, you know, looking to do something this season. Uh, the Gaffer's obviously looking to create a, a hard working culture. Um, you know, there's, there's uh, some, some real good talent here uh, that, that, you know, hopefully I can come in and, and add to. You've played minutes in the Cup though since that league appearance. Are you ready to hit the ground running? Yeah, ready to hit the ground running. Obviously there's a, a bit of a settling in period and, and hopefully we can get the, the paperwork done quick enough today that, that we can be involved tomorrow. But if not, you know, we've got two weeks of, of an international break to, to get bedded in, which could be a bit of a blessing. and you know, re really kick on from there. Yeah, will that be a bonus for you to have two weeks to get to know the lads and, and the environment? Yeah, I think it helps. Um, I'm experienced enough and, and moved enough to, to, to sort of know how to settle in. And obviously I've uh, got a young family, so looking to get them up here and, and having that two week sort of break, that week, week's break from, from a game, if you like, helps get that sort of stuff in order. So uh, it's a positive from, from that side of, of things and obviously to get to grips with, with how the gaffer wants things done and, and how he wants to play. So. Uh, it's, it's a nice period now of, of settling in and, and, and looking forward. Plenty of Hull City connections at Aston Villa. Did you speak to any of them? Before yeah, the yeah. Meet? Obviously, I had a, had a brief chat with with Chesie yesterday. Um, couldn't speak highly enough of, of the club and and, and the area uh, to certain places to live in, um, the supporters and, and and you know what the club stand for. So I'm looking, as I say, a new challenge for me and, and looking forward to, to getting stuck in and, and hitting the ground running. You touched upon it earlier, but what did you see on that night when you played against us? I saw a way of playing, you know, I thought, thought the lads, they, they, they made it really hard for Villa that night. Um, it was a game that, that could have gone either way um, and, and sort of reflecting on it, you know, we, from Villa's point of view, we felt a little bit fortunate that night to come away with, with the victory that we did. Um, you know, the gaffer's obviously got a distinct way of playing that, that I've played against many times over the years and, and to come in and, and be a part of that and, and hopefully add to that is, is, is an exciting challenge for me. Plenty of competition at the heart of the defence, are you relishing that? Yeah, listen, you, you need a squad to do anything in this division, so many games and, 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 and competition's healthy. Um, as I say, it's a young group, so hopefully I can come in and not only add to the group from a, a playing perspective, but from a mentality perspective, you know, it's, it's something that I like doing is, is helping a young group like that and, and bringing the togetherness and, and um, you know, I've been fortunate enough to, to win a promotion from this league, so I know what it takes and sometimes, you know, it's, it's just realising that you have got what it takes and, and a little bit of confidence and, and momentum can take you a long way and, you know, if I can add to the group, as you say, it's a, a strong set of, of centre-halves here, so it's not as if I'm, I'm walking into a team, you know, I've got to prove myself, um, which is healthy and, and, and I'm looking forward to that. What will you bring to the group personally in terms of your own attributes and strengths? Ah, oh, listen, look, I'm not one to come in now and, and start talking myself up. Hopefully the, the football will do the talking on, on my behalf and, um, as I say, mentality is such a, a big thing in this division and, and certainly, you know, I'll be bringing that and, and trying to work hard every day and dragging a few through with me, if you like. Taking the championship as a whole, it's a league you've got plenty of experience in. Is it as tough as ever this season? Um, yeah, yes and no. I think, um, as I say, confidence and, and momentum can take you so far in this division. Um, we're, we're, we're really early doors at the moment to, so, to start sort of judging league positions and, and where teams are at is, is a silly thing to be doing right now. You know, things are still getting bedded in. You're only two or three weeks away from, from stringing plenty of games and plenty of results together and, and it takes you a long way in this league. Uh, you touched upon it, if you, you do manage to get the paperwork completed in time, you're relishing a, a potential debut against Derby? Yeah, hopefully. Um, I'm not sure where we stand at the moment, but you know I'm ready. Um, as I say, I'm fit. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm in a good place mentally. You know, I'm, I'm excited about the new challenge, excited to be working under the gaffer and his team and, and, and looking to add to a, to a, to a strong group. 
and just to check your pre-match superstition with the puss, is that still still active? Yeah, it's still active, yeah, there's, there's plenty of them, so, uh, and that's just something I'd do to, to get me in a, a certain headspace and, and get myself ready, so hopefully we'll be seeing it soon. Just to explain, what do you do? <laughs> it's too much, it, it starts in the morning, but yeah, there's, there's a little ritual I like to go through before the game, but um, so it's something I've picked up over many years and, and it just gets me where, where I like to be.